2012, we, um, we put two plans together. One was um, a development plan for the centre here, and the other then was a, a plan to, um, to try and promote the Irish language. So with those two plans, we, we um, spoke to the community. We had groups in that we, we sat and did a bit of brainstorming, tried to find out exactly what the community need, needed. Those plans were launched and we worked um, on those plans to the best of our ability. And we, there were so many, especially in the, the development plan, there were so many bits and pieces that the community had wanted, the community garden being one of them. So we worked our way through um, the plan as much as we could and um, then I suppose when you, when we did manage to, to get through as much of the plan as we could, it was time to sit down again and um, meet with the community again and try and find out exactly what do they want because we find that the needs will always change and it's very important for us that we need to change and um, that we must be always willing to try something new and um, we, we started then, we, we um, decided that we would do a needs assessment in conjunction with the primary care team. Um, the idea of um, the, the needs assessment was um, to, to find out not only what we were doing at community level and our impact on the community, it was also um, what we were doing with regards to health and well-being and with regards to family life. Um, what, was there anything that we could do? Um, with regards to family life. That document again was um, that was um, launched in 2017 and um, out of that we well in order to get um, the, the I suppose the, to find out the needs of the community we met with 21 focus groups throughout the parish and that was really from mothers with on, on with newborn babies, um, primary school children, secondary school children, then um, uh, um, ch or the youth between 15 and 24, um, and then obviously parents, um, men and women, and um, uh, in the end up then, I suppose we had two open forums to make sure that we just didn't miss anybody and the elderly.